Hello there, God bless you. God is giving me this word for someone. He says that God does not judge nor condemn you. Jesus is not condemning you. He is not judging you. I gave a prophetic word earlier and I said, we do not have a high priest who does not understand. One of the advantages of our high priest is that he lived and walked on the earth. So he understands everything you're going through. He understands how difficult it is to live in the flesh. And that is why the Bible says in the book of Romans chapter 8 and verse 34. Romans 8, 34. Let's get it. It says that, who then will condemn us? Will Christ? No. For he is the one who died for us and came back to life again for us and is seated at the place of highest honor next to God, pleading for us there in heaven. He is seated at the right hand of God the Father where he is making intercessions for us continuously. God is not condemning you. He died for you and he resurrected ascended into heaven he is making intercessions for you when the next time someone tells you god is mad at you or jesus is mad and you know no tell them it is not true he's not mad at me he is madly in love with me that is why he's making intercessions continuously continuously even in the book of ephesians we see that jesus is, has been our intercessor for the longest time possible. He's not mad at you. He is madly in love with you, making intercessions for you to the Father all the time. So don't let um, yourself be trapped in guilt. Don't let anybody tell you that Jesus is mad at you or God is mad at you. Intercessions are going up continuously for you. Hallelujah. God bless you.